Hi, my name is Blue. I'm the founder of White Party Bangkok. So we started White Party Bangkok in 2015. I co-produced with my brother, who is happened to be straight. You know, I was more like a nerd. I was into, you know, books, plants, pets, that kind of thing. And my brothers were into sport. So we were really different. And I went to study in Canada, and he stayed in Bangkok. We kind of grew apart. But for some reason, we end up working in the same industry, which is entertainment industry. By the time that my brother and I came together and wanted to create our own event, we know one thing for sure is that by that time, we have produced hundreds of events combined from small event for a few hundred people to a massive stadium-sized concerts for 50, 60,000 people. For what we know, one thing for sure is that we have the expertise to do this and do it well. And for me, as a gay man, producing something like White Party Bangkok is something that is personal to me. I have lived in Canada for about 15 years and then I moved back to Bangkok. In both places, the LGBTQ plus community is accepted and sometimes celebrated. But I know this is not a luxury that everyone has, especially for many of our friends who live in Asia. Being themselves is a challenge. So to create a safe space for our community to come together, to connect and celebrate who they are without judgment and feel safe doing that is something that is close to my heart. I think that's one of the main reasons why I want to create a gay dance festival of this magnitude in Asia. When an event is successful, it's easy to repeat the same formula and think that uh, the same success will continue because you're using the same formula that you've been using. And it might fall a while, but you have to remember that um, our music taste change. What we like now is very different from what we like you know, five or six years ago. But music culture also changes, so you have to keep evolving with the time not just, you know, keep repeating what you've been doing and think that success will continue. So at this last White Party Bangkok, we welcomed over 30,000 people from 93 countries from all over the world. And when we first started the event, we would have never imagined it would have got this massive. But what excites me and my brother the most is not when people tell us that they just went to the biggest gay dance event, but what excites us is when they tell us that they just experienced something extraordinary, something that they have not seen at any sort of event worldwide that they have attended, and that they have made unforgettable memories, lifelong friendships, and they want to come back. And I think if that's what we hear as an event organizer, we have actually what we set out to do. Many of you have been to White Party Bangkok multiple times over the years and my brother and I would like to thank you, you guys so much for your continued support. It means so much to us and our team. We promise to continue pushing the envelope in terms of production and music program so that each time you come back, there will always be something new for you. Once again, thank you and we hope you had a great time at this past year's White Party Bangkok and we can't wait to welcome you back this year.